I'm Gilbert Hill. I'm founder of Optinon and business development director at OneTrust Technology. The relationship between cookies and compliance began around about five years ago with the advent of the original EU cookie law. Now, like a lot of other people, I only dimly understood cookies as small snippets of code which make the web work in terms of personalization. But the cookie laws are of a stimulus for me and many others to learn more about how cookies are used to build up profiles and track web users. And this started a wave of regulation and awareness which is, which is growing and is only moving in one direction towards greater oversight of digital marketing. And if you're a responsible company, that's a good thing. If, if we think of the EU cookie laws as a dress rehearsal for getting serious about um, web compliance, then the GDPR being pan-European, unified, is the real deal. And it's complex precisely because it's the closest thing that the planet has at the moment to a framework for the ethical capture, management and use of personal data for digital marketing. And the penalties for not getting with the programme are very high, both in terms of financial and brand. In 2017, with the advent of new pieces of legislation like the e-privacy regulation, we're seeing lawmakers hone in on web compliance. So if you've got a website and you're displaying a cookie banner, you've done audits, you've got a privacy notice, that's a great first step, but it should only be seen as a first and not the final step in an ongoing program of web compliance with GDPR. Mm -hmm.